Today I'm going to change these spark plugs on this Yamaha 115 outboard four stroke. So I just popped the top off of there, you can see it. It's 115 as I mentioned, outboard. And I've never got at these before, so I'm just looking here. And there just looks to be, oh, you can't see it there on my finger, but it's just, just plastic cover. And you can see that sliding out. I'm working with one hand here, I'm by myself. So that's just going to pull out and there's going to be one there and the same up here. You can see that, see that moving. I'm going to literally just slide that out and the same thing's going on over here. I would assume. Yeah, there it is right there. This guy right here. And uh, where's it at down here? It's right here. It's actually in a different, looks to be in a different location. So this is just kind of snap out. I'll snap that off. I have to put the camera down while I'm doing that. And I'll snap this out and that should expose our four spark plugs. So I've got my cover off. No problems. I'll put this over here. And my four plugs are right here. One, two, three and four and what i'm gonna do is replace one at a time so i'll pop one out and i'll replace it and here's our replacement plug this is according to the specifications oh here it is so this is what's going back 115 yamaha outboard just gonna pull each wire back you want to get it as far up as you can so you don't damage anything so I'm reaching my fingers up there as far as I can and I'll just it's not pretty easily and you can see it there there's the first one coming out first guy out and Placement. And I'm just putting the new one back in. <clears throat> and I forgot to mention I'm using a 16 mil socket. And I think that's good. One in. And put the cap back on. One done. Three more to go. Number two coming out. Number two going back in. No problems, no issues so far. One and two are in successfully. And there's number three. He's coming out. Just on a side note, you want to have a nice long extender here. I had to piece two um, socket sets together to make this work because uh, this is in here pretty, that's in there pretty deep. And the, uh, the one that came with this set, it actually wouldn't have reached. So I had to find another set and piece it together. So you want to have that ready to roll. And I did mention this, it's a 16 mil or I believe a 5 8 socket. Last plug out, and I'll put the, uh, the next one and the last one in, right there. Four plugs are in. Um, gotta be honest, there wasn't really much to that. Uh, a couple of little reminders, I just did one plug at a time. They're, uh, they're labeled here on this, right? One, two, and you can see three and four here. And, um, when you're putting the caps back on, um, there's just one little click to push it in. And you'll hear it, you'll feel and hear the click when it's going in. So I'm just gonna put the plate, this plate, back on. And okay, and go on one hand here. This you can see is gonna go on that little rubber part there. And this will clip right here. 
And then I'm gonna come around to the other side. I'll have to do this off camera again, I apologize. And that's, that's gonna clip just where it's going in there. And this one is going to clip where you see it going in there. But again, I'm gonna have to do this off camera and I'll show you the finished product. I did this one here first. And then I went up and I slid this one in. And then I'm gonna come around and tuck tuck that in and then this guy up here is going to go on there and this one here and that went on that must have slid on when i slid on the top one and that's it there's a plate back on a little plastic cover and now i'll pop the cover back on the motor